Katie Bird, proud spokesperson for Red Heart Yarns, and I would like to show you how to make this pennant and pom-pom garland using the new and improved Red Heart Pompadoodle yarn and some craft felt. It's really easy and just uses a few supplies. For this project, you will need one skein of Red Heart Pompadoodle yarn in the color of your choice. You will also need some felt sheets, a good pair of scissors, and some glue to attach the felt to the pompadoodle. Let's go ahead and jump in. To begin, the space between each one of our pom-poms on the new pompadoodle is about four inches. So we wanna make sure we cut our felt triangles smaller than that, so approximately three inches. To do that, go ahead and take your craft felt and fold it in half lengthwise. Once you've done that, go ahead and fold it in half widthwise. Once you have folded it in half widthwise, on the end that has the, the fold, okay, we want that one closest to us, so I have a fold over here and a fold over here. I will take my tape measure, and starting at the fold, I'm gonna come out to about an inch and a half, okay, because that's half of three inches. And it's at that three an inch and a half point that I am going to start right here and come up to the tip of my felt to get my triangle. By cutting it along that portion, we have left the fold open. So now this fold can rest directly onto the string attaching the two pompadoodles. Once you've cut all of your triangles, go ahead and take your pompadoodle yarn and you wanna measure out however long you want your garland to be. So um, it's recommended 72 inches or longer. It's completely up to you and you can add as many or as few triangles as you want to your garland. Once you have your garland measured out, I like to keep two or three palms unused before I jump into where I'm gonna add my pennants. Once I find the position I want my pennant, go ahead and take your triangle you cut and position it between two of the palms. Then you'll take your crafter's glue and simply add a little bit of glue to the felt itself and fold the pennant over the pompadoodle and let it dry. And there you have it. You've created a really cute pennant and pom-pom garland that you can use to decorate your next party, baby shower, or heck, maybe even just a room in your house. Hopefully you've enjoyed this video and you'll give it a thumbs up and smash that like button. I'm Marley Bird, proud spokesperson for Red Heart Yarns. Bye. Everything you need to know about knitting or crochet can be found right here on the Marley Bird YouTube channel. Learn with Marley Bird. Visit youtube.com forward slash Marley Bird.